Hello everybody and welcome back to my playthrough of the Railroad Tycoon 3 scenarios with the Coast to Coast expansion pack and the 1.05 patch. So, whoops, new scenario today. Uh, not the tutorial. Um, now, I have had a request for a more modern scenario because obviously previously all other ones have been like the 1800s. Um, so we're going to go for a modern one. Um, and the one that we'll be doing is right at the bottom, it's Tex-Mex. So, uh, if you've seen my Texas T scenario, um, or campaign playthrough, yes, it's the same map. We are in Texas, again. Um, except this time it's not 1888, it's 1993. And I've actually never played this scenario, I've only ever seen other people play it, uh, so I've no very little about it. But, I'll be playing on Expert, because uh, I'm an idiot. Anyway, Tex-Mex on Expert, 1993. The implementation of a high-speed railway connection between the Texas Triangle cities, Dallas, Fort Worth, Austin, San Antonio, and Houston, is your task here in the Lone Star State. Okay. And we are Edward Henry Harriman, who, historically, was the chairman of the Union Pacific Railroad, so he's long dead in 1993. Uh, and let's have three AI. Why not? Uh, all these people are dead in 1993, but that doesn't make any difference. Um, so let's go. And again, I know the objectives, roughly, and I know the map, because it's the same as Texas T, but I don't know anything about like the industry or how easy it is to make money, best starting positions. Um, I really don't know anything about this scenario. I've never played it before myself, so um, it'll be a bit of an adventure. Anyway, map hasn't fully loaded, so I'll rotate when it has loaded. Which will be when I close this menu. The state of Texas has an increasingly urgent need for high-speed rail transportation systems between its largest and fastest growing cities. Bureaucracy and an outdated system have stopped this project for decades. It can't wait any longer and failure now would be catastrophic for the state and you. Build it and they will come. We hope. Well, where's my rail network that I built in Texas T? Some idiots destroyed it. Oh well. Bronze. Connect Dallas, Austin, San Antonio, and Houston within 25 years. Silver. Connect Dallas, Austin, San Antonio, and Houston within 25 years and maintain an average express speed of 40 miles an hour. That's quite fast. I mean, yeah, we are using modern trains, but that is still quite fast. I mean, it's express, uh, so it doesn't count freight. So if we only build freight trains, and then have maybe one or two express trains, just here and there, and set them to high priority. Assuming we're still making money just delivering freight, we might... well, we, we'll, we'll see. Gold connects cities of Dallas, Austin, San Antonio and Houston, maintain an average express speed of 50 miles an hour, that is insane, and have a personal net worth of 25 million or more. Okay, so we have to worry about uh, shares and personal net worth, and if you've seen my Texas T, you'll see how well that went. On the other hand, if you've seen my Britain scenario, that was easy. My net worth exploded. Special conditions, you may not start multiple companies, I wasn't planning to anyway. You may not issue bonds. That's a bit of a worry, because that's a very easy way of getting money. Especially if we get a margin call. <laughs> okay. State of Texas will provide some assistance for your railway. However, you'll need to determine which system you plan on using. Diesel or electric. Now. Diesel... Are cheaper... Uh, because they don't require electric track. I think they're possibly less reliable, maybe they're slower. 
Uh, electric, I think, are more reliable, but they're more expensive. This is America, so I think if we went with diesel, they'd have more choice, because America tends to use more diesels than electrics. Um, I'm going to go with diesel. Sorry, electric fan. Sorry, electric train fan people out there. Uh, but I think we're going with diesel. I don't know what the difference is. Is it just what I can buy, or is there some kind of event later on that uh, means... Like, um... Anyway. So, the bronze goal was Dallas, Austin, San Antonio, and Houston, and they're the only cities we actually specifically have to connect. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in Odessa, San Angelo. Um... Not that much in Austin or San Antonio. In fact, there's not much, to be honest. A lot of it is in Dallas. Uh, we don't have to connect to Fort Worth, which is a bit weird. Anyway, let's start a company. And I think we'll be the Union Pacific. Because they did... Uh, well, they still exist. And we are E.H. Harriman. And the Union Pacific does go to Texas. And we start with... 4.4 million with which to build the railroad. That's very nice. And we are Union Pacific. You'll receive a fuel subsidy of 20% for using diesel locomotives. Okay. Um, I'd rather it be cheaper to buy diesel locomotives, but uh, you get what you're given. So let's just look at territories. Mexico is still 1 million. We have access to Texas, New Mexico, Oklahoma, Arkansas, and Louisiana. Now, we can build unconnected track, uh, I think. Yep, we can build unconnected track. So we could do Austin, San Antonio, and then Dallas Fort... Well, Dallas Fort Worth, with these modern trains, is not going to make much money. Um... Nacogdoches doesn't have anything, really. Houston, Beaumont. Probably want to connect over to San Angelo, maybe. There's a lot of logs that we... Hmm. A lot of log... I don't know. Let's just do... We do have a lot of money, so let's just do Dallas, Fort Worth. And then coming out of there... We can have some kind of strange junction. Like that. Um, now let's go with a medium... No. Okay, we'll need a large station for Fort Worth. And a medium station... No, large station for Dallas. And build a maintenance coming out of Fort Worth and a maintenance coming out of Dallas. Uh, water tower there. And a water tower... Well, actually, let's just keep going to Austin. Again, I've never played this scenario. I know nothing about it, so bear with me. I really, I'm, I'm, I might have been making a really stupid mistake here, but um, let's just go with Iron Bridges. Uh, is there anything in Killeen? Um, no. Dallas on track. Union Pacific connects Dallas to the new high-speed railway. Uh, well, it's not built yet, but uh, we're, we're getting there. Um, so, Dallas to Austin, and avoid the hills. I'll avoid the hills, ideally. Um, huh, okay. Austin connected. Uh, we didn't manage to connect the entire city of Austin, but we do have Austin, nonetheless. And also connect over to San Antonio. And build maintenance coming out of Austin. And a maintenance coming out of San Antonio. And water. It's a service tower, really, because it's not water. It's, it's just sand. Um, so we actually won't really need that many. Because it's diesels. They don't use water, they just use sand. Sand and oil. And we've got San Antonio. And we could connect over to Houston, I guess. How much are trains? 
Oh, we do have some electric trains. We do have access to electric trains. Um. Hmm. Diesels. We have the FP45, the GP7, and the F3. Uh, the FP45 is very fast, but not very good on the hills. But there aren't me there aren't any hills really. The GP7 is very good on hills. And the F3 is not very good on hills. The F3 is... Uh, I'm thinking of going with an FP45. It's more expensive to buy, and it's more expensive to maintain, but it's a lot faster. Uh, passengers like it a bit better. It's less reliable. It's better acceleration. Let's just do that. But just out of interest... Wow. Okay, there's a lot of freight in Dallas that wants to go from Fort Worth to Dallas. And then the meat wants to go all the way to San Antonio and Austin. Is there anything in Waco? Oh, we didn't even connect to Waco. Oops. Sorry, Waco. That was an accident. It wasn't intentional. Oh god, I can't connect to the I can't connect the whole city. Because of my stupid placement of stuff. Huh, okay. I could build like a station like that. In fact, let's just let's just do that. It's, it's a bit silly, I know, but uh, bear with me. So Waco isn't on the actual like main line itself. Waco is kind of like a detour. Um, the, the main line goes from San Antonio to Dallas, and it also goes to Fort Worth. Anyway, is there anything in Waco? That's what I want to know. Some cotton we could ship over to Dallas. Or Fort Worth. There's some uh, livestock that wants to go to Dallas. Yeah, so let's do a train going from Dallas to Austin. Um, there aren't actually any passengers really, so let's just do freight, and that that means we don't have to worry about our express speed or anything. Um. In fact, actually, we may as well go with a GP7 in that respect. That's making some nice money. Austin. Is there actually any express anywhere? The most express is in Fort Worth. Where's some passengers that want to go between Dallas and Fort Worth? Okay. This meat in Fort Worth wants to go over to San Antonio. So let's do a San Antonio-Fort Worth line. With freight only. And then Austin. Hang on. We've got Dallas to Austin and San Antonio to Fort Worth. What about Austin to San Antonio? That would make money. That's interesting. There's a recycling plant in Austin. So. It converts waste into steel, paper, and aluminium. Now, because it, because it's 1993, there are a lot more industries than the, than we used to in like the old timey um, land. Um, so I have to. I'm not used to these, if I'm being brutally honest. Um, can't take out bonds. We can issue stock, but we do have to worry about our net worth. Um, and we do have three AI, so it'll be interesting to see what they do. I think for now, we'll just go. And just see how we do. So we're doing Dallas, Austin, and San Antonio, Fort Worth. And actually, we forgot, Waco, we forgot completely forgot about Waco. So Waco to... Dallas... Would be good. And then... You could do um, Dallas Waco, Waco Dallas Dallas Waco, freight only. Okay, that's making some nice money as well. I mean, later on, 
later on when we start connecting up more places, we can start running some express trains. Is there anything in Tyler? No. There wasn't anything in Tyler in Texas T either, which is a bit unusual. Nothing in Huntsville. And uh, not Oh, Victoria has a tire factory, but there are There's no rubber in the entire map. Um Is there? No, there's no rubber in the entire map, so that tire factory is completely useless. Um Iron Mine We don't have to worry about industry profits. But we will want to connect Houston. And maybe Beaumont, although it's not that useful, not that big. Let's build a station in... in oh, piss. I, I, I twitched and uh, missed out the uh, ports by building my station. Oops, that's 200,000 down the drain. Okay, try again. Yeah, I slightly misclicked, uh, moved the mouse ever so slightly, and built the station in the wrong place. So I basically just wasted 200,000. Oops. Oh well. Ooh, new locomotive is available. The USA 103, so named because it has a top speed of 103 miles an hour, apparently. Uh, passengers love it. It's okay on the hills, actually. And it's very fast. Uh, it's very, very fast, actually. Passengers really like it. It's very reliable. It's very good acceleration. That, we can use as our express train. I mean, obviously, it can still haul freight, but... Uh, we can just use it as an express train. So, once we actually connect over to Houston... We've got a bronze already. So it's actually really easy to get the bronze medal. Um, and the silver shouldn't be too hard. And go it's, it's the gold that we have to worry about. Getting this net worth. Let's buy some shares on the margin. Because it should go up. And let's set a dividend. Not a stupidly high dividend, but a dividend nonetheless. And we have our first competitors. Uh, we have two of the three competitors. We have Odessa La Mesa and Oklahoma City and Lawton. Um, we don't really have to worry about them. We can actually buy out other people. Uh, so we can do everything... We can do everything we normally do, we just can't buy or take out bonds. Uh, which is annoying, if I'm being honest. Later on we may want to double some of this track up, but... Uh, ah, we've got another competitor, the San Angelo Abilene. Uh, so... I think... Yeah, those were the two routes that we had in Texas T, which is a bit unusual. Hmm. Anyway. So, obviously, our main goal will be connecting over to Houston. And it's going to be, it's going to be difficult to make money because we are only hauling freight at the moment. But some express is starting to turn up. Um, ooh, there's some meat in Waco that we could haul over to San Antonio. And there's some clothes as well that want to go to San Antonio. So let's do Waco, San Antonio. Like so. Hauling any freight. Waiting for track to clear. It's making some money. Um, just as long as we haul freight, and freight only... Uh, then we should be o then we'll be okay for did we do Dallas San Antonio I don't think we did let's do that Dallas San Antonio all the way pulling any freight okay so we made good money that year 
But not being able to take out bonds is going to be a bit of a, a pain, if I'm honest. Um. Also, we have to worry about our net worth, because we need 25 million in net worth. Hmm. That's going to be a, a bit of a pain as well. Hmm. We'll need a maintenance and a serv and like service tires coming out. Oh dear. Why is this train hauling nothing? Now it's hauling something. Huh. This is very weird. There's still a whole load of freight in Dallas that wants to go... Well, it's just a lot of clothes that want to go to Houston. Livestock. It might not actually be a bad idea to do a Dallas-Fort Worth line. Because there seems to be a lot of, like, stuff that wants to go between Dallas and Fort Worth. Rather unusual, if I'm honest. Growing prosperity. Just a shame we can't take out any loans. I mean, I could issue stock, but that would lower our net worth. Okay. Can't buy a train, because the cheapest train, I think, is... That's a weird price for a train. I think the... Yeah, the cheapest train... Oh, we can't even get it anymore! Damn! Oh boy. So the cheapest train we can get now that's actually a diesel is 420,000. Oh wow. I mean it's good. The FP45 is very good, but it's just a shame it's expensive. Damn. Okay, let's Hmm. Oh boy. Okay. Still need to get over to Houston. Avoiding the hills. Uh, that would cost about $360,000. So, come on. So, we do need a good haul. I may have to start, in, I may have to start hauling the Express, if I'm honest. Um, where is the Express? There's Express in Fort Worth. Wants to go between Dallas and Fort Worth. Okay. Wants to go. Yeah, a lot of Express wants to go between Dallas and Fort Worth. Uh, Waco, San Antonio, or Waco, Dallas. Hmm. Annoyingly, a lot of stuff wants to go to Houston. Waco San Antonio might not be that bad. Austin. Austin San Antonio. If only I could take out... If I could take out a bond, I'd take out a bond right now and I'd do a load more trains. But I can't at the moment. Well, you can't take out a bond there. You can't ever take out a bond. Ah. Share price is going down because we're not making that much money. Okay, let's. Uh, I don't want to issue the stock. Okay, let's just do. San Antonio Fort Worth. No, they, they do want to go Dallas Fort Worth. Okay, let's do Fort Worth to Dallas. Make it a high priority train and just deliver any cargo with a dining car. So this train will be like our express train. It's not even doing 50 miles an hour now. Huh. Okay, we need longer route if we're going to be getting some express trains. How about Dallas? Dallas to Fort 
Dust Waco. Dust Austin. Oh boy. I don't know why, we're just not making any money. Okay, this is probably a bad idea, because this is probably... Huh, this just isn't fast enough. Huh. Okay, we made a bit of money there. Right, change this... Change this back to any freight. Change it back to uh, normal priority. I don't know what the average was for that, but probably not great, if I'm honest. Okay. Ha. Huh. We can't even get the FP45. So it's basically USA 103 or nothing. Wow, this stinks. Okay, I'm going to issue the stock. And connect over to Houston. Via San Antonio. And we are connected over. Right. So we now, if nothing else, we have the bronze. But that's not hard. So Houston has a whole lot of stuff. So we want to do Houston to Austin. Uh, yeah, we definitely want to do Houston to Austin. Um, so, get rid of this useless line. Do Houston, Austin. And just deliver any freight for now. Just stick with freight. Boom times! Makes no difference to me, really. I can't take out bonds. Which I'm really pissed off about, to be honest. Although it does mean that our share price will start to go up. Huh. In fact, actually, meant it's a high priority train. Why not? I just realised that high priority trains. Uh, actually, it should still work. Wow. This is not going well. And in fact, we're actually making a loss right now. Hmm. This is worrying. Oh boy. Not being able to take out loans really takes its toll. Current average express speed is 22 miles an hour. Ugh. I mean, I know we didn't do that many hauls, but... Wow, this is tough. This is really tough. Hmm. We just can't make enough money from freight. Can't make enough money just just from freight. Well, actually, we we are starting to make a bit of money, so uh, things may pick up. Fuck! Come on, let me build this tower. San Angelo and Abilene has declared bankruptcy. Wow. And everyone's just buying shares of San Angelo and Abilene. They're annoyed with us. They're fed up with these guys. They're neutral with these guys. And they're fed up with these guys. Yeah, these guys are just... They've not been fading. Um, wow, these guys are just plummeting. As are these guys and these guys. Yeah, no one's really doing very well. Um, yeah, those guys are doing terrible. 
As are these guys. Those guys are making a small profit. So, even though we're not doing very well, we're still the best, in theory, company out there. Huh. Okay. Where's the Express? The Express is in Fort Worth, and it wants to go to San Antonio, Waco. It still wants to go to Dallas. No. Dallas, Fort Worth. They just want to do a load of Express between the two. And we're making a huge loss, to be honest. Toy Factory has appeared in Beaumont. Uh, but there's no plastics for the toys. Oh boy. Economy's slowing. Oh, good grief. I'm going to change this back to a normal priority. Oops. There we go. We're barely making money. I don't know if this is I don't know if this is meant to be like a tough scenario or if I'm just doing it badly. Oh god. I don't have enough money for a train. If I issue stock. Yeah, but our stock price just keeps going down and down and down. Oh god, fuck it, I'm issuing stock. That still doesn't give us enough money to buy a train. And the stock price has plummeted. Let's buy some stock of ourselves. For God's sake. Right. Where the hell does this express want to go? It wants to go to San Antonio to... Ah, bloody hell. Austin San Antonio would be decent. If we actually got enough money to buy the frickin' train. Oh, there's a new train available. Uh, it's more expensive, and the passengers hate it. But it's very good on the hills. And it's very fast and very reliable. Huh. Come on. Give me 400,000 so I can get a train. Yes, right. Okay, USA 103 between San Antonio and Austin. You will deliver... Uh, let's just deliver anything. Okay. That's just going extremely fast. Because it's a... Uh, Ultra fast acceleration. Uh, and it's got a very high top speed as well, so. Maybe all is not lost just yet. Maybe we can get a silver. Well, there aren't actually that many express. Um, we want to go to Houston, interestingly enough. So let's do. San Antonio to Austin, and then to Houston, and then set this to high priority, and then Houston, bloody hell, there's a lot of stuff in Houston that wants to go to Austin and San Antonio, so let's do, yep, Houston back to San Antonio, like so. It's gone up to 28. With this train, it will go up even further, but 50 is going to be insane to do. And our share price is starting to go up again, so let's buy some more on the margin. Set the dividend back up. All's not lost just yet. And buy back some... S no, actually, that's not buyback stock. Last year, we made a fortune. What happened? I don't know. I don't know what happened last year, but we're doing very well. So these are just all our freight trains. And then this is our express... Well, actually, it's just mixed, really. It just hauls whatever it feels like. 
So hopefully it will do some express though. Uh, which it does. I may want to upgrade this to uh, one of these. Just make it a bit faster. Uh, upgrade this to one of these. We can't quite afford it. Now we can. Upgrade that to a that. Oh yeah, we're making a lot of money now, for whatever reason. I think our express I think the express speed only updates every year, which is a bit of a nuisance. Because it means that I never actually get to properly know what it is. But for whatever reason, we're now making good money. Uh, let's buy some more shares in ourselves. It's gone up to 31. Huh. Um, let's do Austin to... Hmm. I would say Austin to Dallas, maybe? Yeah, let's do Austin to Dallas. And just haul anything. It's not even delivering any uh, express. A bit annoying. Let's just put it on, it on high priority anyway. Yeah, I still want to do Dallas-Fort Worth, so let's give them Dallas-Fort Worth. Or Fort Worth-Dallas, rather. Just deliver anything. Um, and set that to a high-priority train. And it's just doing nothing but express, interestingly enough. So it doesn't average 50, but... It going fairly fast, if I'm honest. Um, upgrade this to one of these things. These things are great. Um, although we might be better suited with these. These are faster. But these are... Actually... For all intents and purposes, the USA is better. The only advantage of these is uh, hills, but there aren't any hills. We suspended the dividend because we can't afford to pay it. Oh well. Buy some more shares. And we've got a train! Very nice. And it's a speed record on one of our specific express trains, so we'll get even more money from that. How on earth are we going We need 50 miles an hour and 25 million in net worth. That's, that's insane, if I'm honest. Okay, let's upgrade this to a USA. So now I know, now I know we just want basically everything to be a USA. Actually, we're going to need to double up some track. Um, double up track around Dallas. Uh, and round here, round here. And double up round here. And double up round Austin. Because obviously it's meant to be a high speed rail. Uh, we want, uh, well, high speed. And uh, high speed comes from doubling up your track. We are making a lot of money, which is very, very nice. So let us increase the dividend back up. Uh, let's just... No, let's not buy back some stock. Have some more shares on the margin. 
Huh. So the guy who filed for bankruptcy has now been fired. The San Angelo Abilene. Highly excited. Awarding a bonus and a salary increase. It's gone up to 33. That's still not high enough. No way near high enough. So how can we make that better? Well, we could haul less loads. That would make it a bit faster. Um... Uh, I'd rather not do that, because then we make less money. This isn't actually hauling anything. I just realised we, really, we don't need that anymore, because we've already got Fort Worth Dallas hauling anything. Well, actually, let's just see if it hauls anything. No, I don't think we need it. Let's get rid of that train. Okay. Um... So what we want is a nice, long express train from, I'm thinking, well, where's the express? Austin? Hmm. Problem is, there isn't actually a lot of express. Maybe we just have to wait for better locomotives. I mean, we do have from, like, 1993 to 2018, and, uh, later on we'll get some better trains. Huh. There's nothing faster than a 103. Yeah, the we don't exactly have a lot of trains available to buy. Um, if we look on the map at the cargo... There's a lot in San Angelo, a lot in Odessa. Um, huh. Is there anything really in Beaumont? No, not really. I'm a bit wary of expanding because... Uh, Like, where do you expand to? That's the question. Yeah, so he's been fired because he's just making the loss every year. Those guys are actually making a bit of money. And those guys are not doing well. Huh. I don't think we can really do anything other than just... Uh, keep doing what we're doing at the moment. The stock will split, or at least it should split. Uh, we are in economic normal status, which is interesting. Hmm. Buy back some stock. Buy some more shares in ourselves. And... If we get a margin call in this map, it's going to be incredibly hard to fix because... Uh, no bonds. Uh, let's just decrease the dividend. Growing prosperity! Very nice. Can't increase that anymore. Stock will split. Uh, that should increase my net worth by quite a lot. I really want that to go up. Plastics factory has appeared near Corpus Christi. Is there any oil? Oh, surprise, surprise, there's oil in Nacogdoches. Stock split two for one. So we now have... It's only gone up to 34. Damn. I may have to reduce the amount of these haul. But... I'm, re I'm very reluctant to do that. Actually, there's some stuff that's appeared in Killeen. Some logs and some lumber. 
So let's do a station in Killeen. And do freight. Unless there's any like express. Uh no. Logs that want to go to San Antonio. No, San Antonio logs. We don't have enough for a train. We want to do San Antonio to Killeen. Hauling freight. That's hauling meats and furniture. Interesting. Huh. Let's check. A lot of express in Austin itself. They want to go from Waco. But they want to go to Houston. Hmm. That's holding nothing back. That's a bit worrying. Change the dividend back up. And it won't let me. So buy back some stock. It's uh, no real points. Buy some more shares in ourselves. We are in economic prosperity. I don't know how. Like. Would Houston Dallas. Maybe Houston Fort Worth? No. I don't know. I'm thinking like a nice long direct route. Actually, let's connect over to Huntsville. I don't think there's anything in Huntsville, but we may as well connect there anyway. Some grain that we can ship. Well, Austin to Huntsville. Let's do that. Just deliver freight back and forth. Waiting for track to clear. Pulling a load of goods and some meat. Interesting. Um, ah, boy. Just the dividend. Steel mill has been in Austin. Uh, there is some iron. Very, very little, if I'm honest. There's a lot of coal that's demanded in this electric... Pl yes, yeah, electric plant's just eating up all the coal and still not making any money. Huh. Okay, it is now 2003. It's gone up to 35. I don't think we can get the gold. I think we might have to settle for silver. Buy some more shares in ourselves. Raise the dividend back up. Even silver's going to be tough to get. Um, like how the hell do you get 50 miles an hour as an average express speed? That's, that's crazy fast. Don't know what just happened there. Huh. 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 I did say I find the old timey stuff easier. Maybe this is a particularly difficult scenario? I don't know. But for whatever reason, I'm not doing very well. And I may have to settle for a bronze. Excuse me. Mm. Okay. Huntsville, oh sorry, Houston to Waco, I think was quite profitable. Um, and then Waco to Austin, I think, was what they wanted. And any ex no, let's just do any cargo. Uh, let's do high priority. There's no actual... Wow! I thought they actually wanted... Ex hmm, apparently not. There were some troops. 
troops between Fort between Dallas and Houston. Nobody actually wants to go to Houston. Hmm. How weird. So we can do Houston to Dallas. Hauling any old rubbish. Aha! With a dining car. And put that on high priority. And... Hopefully this will have a high average speed, which it does. So our average speed is still 35. We have used up nearly half the amount of time we're allowed. Our purchasing power is going quite low, if I'm honest. So let's change the dividend back up. Uh, could buy back some stock. Don't really want to. The Odessa Northern has declared bankruptcy. So the AI are really not doing very well. The economy's slowing. Hmm. This is a really weird scenario because it's quite difficult to make money. There's a lot of stuff in Beaumont. What is it? This port's just showed up. Started supplying coal and turning oil into diesel. Alright, let's just connect over there anyway. Ah, there's an oil ref... Hmm. Oil refinery. Connect over to Beaumont. A lot of lightning! Ah, boy. Okay, so Beaumont has some express wants to go to between Houston and Beaumont. Interesting. Uh, we could do that, I guess. I don't know if it'd be very fast. Because it's not very far. But we could just do it anyway. So, let's do that. Okay. A train between San Antonio and Dallas hauling freight only has crashed and we don't have enough money to replace it. So, San Antonio to Dallas. Uh, what should we do a USA? Uh-huh. Not making as much money this year. Hmm. Okay. We received a broker call. Let's buy back some stock. Buy back some more stock. Buy back some more stock, which we can't do. Okay, that's self- Ah, hang on. Buy stock. Back. Yeah. Buy back the stock. May have bought too much on the margin here. We do have a very big net negative amount of cash. Urgh. Come on, money. I want money for trains. It's got up to 36, so it's increasing, but very, very slowly. Okay, let's do a train from Beaumont to Houston. Haul anything. Oh, fuck's sake. We did have enough. Now we have enough. Right. Beaumont to Houston. Or Houston to Beaumont. I don't know why it's called Houston Junction. Oh, it's because I built that. Right, we want to rename that to Houston, not Houston Junction. And put that on high priority. Okay, rename to Houston. And we want to double up around Houston. Because we're going to get quite a few trains going around Houston. Okay. That's delivering some... delivering lots of passengers. It did have to wait for that other train, it's a bit annoying. And we're in a recession, which is not what I want. Because the share price is going to go down. Increase the dividend. 
Buy back some stock. Buy stock back. Hmm. Just as long as I don't keep getting margin calls. I mean, the company itself is making some nice profit. Um. But. Us ourselves? Us ourselves, we're very close to bankruptcy. Um, which, if that happens, then I'll just concentrate on the silver and we'll just have to accept the silver. To be honest, I think we will get the silver, but I... The, the, we, there's almost no chance of getting the gold. Not when we're 25 million in net worth and 50 miles an hour. Huh. And we used up half our time already. How on earth are you meant to get the gold in this map? Just keep things afloat. Okay, how are we doing? Still 36 miles an hour, but we did make very nice profit last year, even though we're in a re recession, which is very weird. <clears throat> Forgive me. Is it worth buying shares in the AI at $1 a share? Maybe not. And just so when things couldn't get worse, we've gone into a full flesh depression. Okay, so we're just going to have to buy back a ton of shares. Keep things afloat. Hmm. Maybe not the smartest idea. Yeah, that probably wasn't a good idea. Okay, and buy back the stock. Huh. Yeah, buying those shares really did not do anything. It didn't increase our net worth. It, didn't, it, it, it might have decreased our purchasing power, so that was a bad idea. Just keep things afloat. Like. And we've got a broker call. That's quite bad. Can't fix it. Okay, sell those shares. Right, we just temporarily fixed it. Temporarily. Yeah, I'm thinking. Now might be a good idea to just ignore net worth and because we're, we're not going to get the gold. So if our net worth goes to zero, so be it. I'll just concentrate on the silver. The silver is going to be quite straightforward. Okay. I will increase the dividend back up. Uh, yeah, sorry folks, I'm going to have to go with the silver. It'll be my first recorded silver. Oh. Well. We sold off a load of shares of ourselves. The share price is rapidly gone. Okay, screw it. No more net worth. Let's issue off some stock. Sell some shares while that's it. Okay. So the share price has plummeted. I don't care. Net worth, not important. We only care about our express speed. Speaking of which, we can do. That train's crashed. 
We can do Beaumont to Dallas. I think that would be okay. Oops. Actually, we may want to double up some track. How are we doing for traffic? Excuse me. Oh, good grief. Let's double up around here. I'm sorry, folks, but silver is what we're aiming for. Gold is out the window. I didn't expect to get gold. Like... Um... So, I probably should have started on... Or focused on... Uh, or ignoring net worth sooner. So that was kind of a mistake. Oops. We are in negative cash. Oops. Mm, the investors are going to hate us, but I don't think we can be fired, can we? We can't start multiple companies, but we can be fired. We shouldn't get fired. If we get fired, then fuck. That'll be really harsh. And we're in a recession. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, let's do... Beaumont to Dallas, hauling anything. Um, I was actually hauling no... No express, that's interesting. Ah. San Angelo Abilene, which is the first company to declare bankruptcy, has been liquidated. So I could buy them... Hang on. Yeah, they're now fed up with us. Because we really didn't do very well last year, and our share price de massively decreased. What this means is that we could buy them out for $612,000... And we'd get their stations, their track, and their shares, and their service towers, without any debt. Uh, but we don't want to do that. It's just interesting when a company goes into, get, goes into liquidation. Um, we're on 37 miles an hour. We need 40 for the silver. We, we have until 2018. Hmm. Put down a car on this train, because I think we will get some passengers. Yes, so... Where do these passengers actually want to go to? They want to go from San Antonio to Dallas. They want to go from Dallas to... I think we already have San Antonio at Dallas, don't we? Wrong one. Austin, Dallas. Fort Worth, Dallas. Houston, Waco, Austin. Houston, Dallas. We don't have San Antonio, Dallas. So let's do San Antonio, Dallas. Haul anything. And put that onto a high priority train. Double up the main line as much as we can. Uh, the main line obviously being the Dallas San Antonio. I think that's entirely double now, isn't it? Certainly looks that way. That will help things a lot. And we can also double up between Dallas and Fort Worth. And double up around here. That line's not being used, really. So that'll be okay. Okay. Net worth is still positive. Purchasing power is actually... So weirdly, our purchasing power is kind of stabilised, and... Um, yeah, the people that were $1 a share, because they've been liquidated, they basically... They don't exist. Like... Well, they do, but they're kind of in government control. Like, they can't buy anything, and you can't buy shares of them. Um, we've got to keep expanding, but there's not really much point. Like, where would we expand to? That's uh, still at 37. Huh. Uvalde. Probably mispronouncing that. San Angelo, El Dorado. Where do these passengers want to go to? 
What I want is a nice flat stretch of land to haul passengers to and from. And what I'm going to do is build out of Dallas, connect over to Tyler. Uh, large station. Some passengers that want to go from Tyler to Houston. Both ways. And do something like that. And then double up round here. And build water and water and maintenance. And then do Houston Tyler haul any old rubbish and set to a high priority train. And there's no passengers. Damn. Why? I thought there were passengers that wanted to go there. Oh, apparently not. Okay, in that case, set this back to a normal priority train. And just make it freight. The Houston Bullet. Uh, ah, good. There's actually an express train going from Houston to Waco. That's always nice. Um, okay. Dallas, Houston, hopefully it'll take this line as opposed to the main line. But if it takes the main line, that's not a massive issue. Any cargo and a high priority train. And it is taking this line. Good. So even though we barely made any money at the start, we are now making some nice cash. Or nice money, rather. Same thing. And issue off the stock, which we can't do just yet. It's still going to be a push to get to... Uh... I mean, there is a train. The, there's the trains that come out in 2012, but they're electric. And there's 2015, and they're insane. But they're also very expensive. They might help. So between 2015 and 2018, we can start upgrading to them. It might just push us over to the 40 miles an hour, but I doubt it. Anyway, Nakadoshis. Uh, nobody wants to go to Nakadoshis. It's a bit worrying. Nakadoshis. Dallas. Can we issue off the stock? We can't. Okay, let's do Nakadoshis Dallas. Haul anything. And set it to high priority. And it will need maintenance and. Actually, yeah, put a service tower down there. Good thing is, is these trains have outstanding fuel economy, so they really do not need, like, service towers and maintenance facilities. Weirdly, our share price is kind of... It, now we're not worrying about net worth. Our, our net worth has stabilised, and... That's very weird. But we're not worrying about net worth. It's gone up to 38, so we're, we're going... We're going up. There's a chance we can get a silver. Small chance, but a chance. I don't know how the... F how the hell are you meant to get gold? I really don't know how you would get gold in this scenario. Like, 25 million net worth and 50 mile an hour average express speed. That's uh, pretty insane. At least money is not an issue. Anything in There's some stuff in Valde. What is it? Some furniture, maybe? Hmm. I don't think we need to expand, though. I think we just need to make make money and uh, set up fast trains. Okay, Austin. Austin to Beaumont? No, apparently not. Austin to Tyler? No. Boom times! Okay. 
I said to wake her. I think we've already got that. One. Hmm, this is very weird. Uh, Houston is now a five-star city, pretty much. That's really weird. It's good, but it's a bit weird. I think we already have Houston, San Antonio, but let's do that anyway. Pulling anything with a dining car. Uh, there's no actual passengers on that line. Still 38 miles an hour, apparently. So at least it's not going down. But getting it to 40 is going to be really difficult. We are going to need that 200 mile an hour train. The diesel. Which only becomes available in 2015, which is very annoying. Unless we upgrade our track to electric. Which we will do. Yes, let's do that. And then we can use the electric train, which is cheaper and faster. And we can use that in 2012. And I think if we upgrade our trains to that, then silver should be, well, not fairly easy, but easy. Uh, 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 it'll, bleh, not easy, but doable. Let's use some stock. Okay. Right. It's really weird because, like, Houston's now a five star city, San Antonio's three and a half, Austin's four and a quarter, Dallas is nearly five. We've, we have, I don't, I know they were probably quite big to start with, but these train, these stations are, sorry, these cities are now, uh, huge. Thanks to our rail network. Um,. Okay, so, so I'm 38 at the moment. So we can't get it just yet. I think it becomes available in June. I'm going to save the game as Tex-Mex Expert LP. Right. Now these trains cost $800,000 each, but when you see the stats, you'll realise that these trains will be the key to victory because they're insane. They're basically bullet trains. They are electric, which is why I needed to uh, create, um, improve to electric track. Uh, so it should become available soon. And just upgrade the express trains. There we go. It cost one million. Um, I'm guessing maybe because we went with diesel, the electric trains are more expensive. But there you go. Top speed of 300 miles an hour. Passengers love it. It's very it's reliable. Instant acceleration and very good fuel economy. So, we want to do some upgrades to this. Uh, it's one million each, unfortunately. Uh-huh. And watch this thing go. It just goes stupidly fast. There you go. Average speed between wherever it was going of 90 miles an hour. Like, I can't even see the speedo because the train's so long. And we want to upgrade as many of those as possible. And then we'll hopefully get to the 40 miles an hour goal. 121 miles an hour average top speed. Or average speed. And this train has crashed. Oh, this is an express. Okay, we'll have to use the USA. Because we can't afford. We can't actually afford. Okay. So upgrade this. So just issue off the stock to make money, and then upgrade the trains. These trains run out of sand between San Antonio and Houston. Did I not build a water tower? Apparently not. It's got maintenance, that's good. So San Antonio... Well, that, that's going to be upgraded anyway. When we get the money. 
<clears throat> oh, I had it just then. Okay. Upgrade. It's just so fast. It's insanely fast. It's the fastest train in the game, in terms of top speed. Um, so our average top speed has now gone up to 39 miles an hour. Um, still not good enough. Still need the 40. Let's issue the stock, which we can't just yet. Pause the game once we get to a million, which we just did. Upgrade. Oh, I hope I'm, I hope this isn't too little too late. I hope this is actually doable. Still not letting me upgrade the thing. Still not letting me issue off the stock. Oh boy. Yes. Okay. Um, so this is this is Dallas Fort Worth line. So upgrade that. Hmm. Issue the stock. Issue the stock. Uh, upgrade. Oh, that's a uh, just a regular train. Whoops. Um, upgrade this. Ha! I think that's all of them. All the express ones, anyway. Except for this one. Ha! 133 miles an hour average speed. Come on, it's got to go over 40 eventually. And upgrade the final one. I think that's all of them now. I think all express train... Whoa! That needs to be uh, set to that. And Leland Stanford has been fired from the Odessa Northern. The Odessa Northern has declared bankruptcy. Yes! It's gone over 40 and it won't go down. It shouldn't go down. So if everything remains as it is, we've got the silver. <sighs> right. How in the world do you get gold on this scenario? I mean, we're not going to do it now, obviously, but uh, it's just like, how the heck would you get gold? We may as well upgrade some of the other trains to um, this thing. Just for more money, because we don't need more speed. Um, not on the express, anyway. But it means it will haul stuff faster. Yep, this train really does help. it's just insane. Whoops, don't want to retire that train. I'm not giving any special preference, I'm literally just upgrading at random. Average Speed of 161 miles an hour on that train, the Fort Worth Cannonball. Um, okay, the average speed's gone up to 42. I think we're okay. Whoops. So between Dallas and Fort Worth, you can get there. Ah. Oh. Okay, so we can't. 
Oh, d oh that's annoying because that's um, an express train. I have to upgrade it to a USA. And then when we get the money, which we forgot to issue the stock, I'll go back to this thing. Hang on. Oh, it's only reliability good, so it can in it can crash. I was thinking it had a very I was thinking it had like near perfect reliability. Oh well. Just buy some shirt. Share price is going all over the place. I don't care, really. I've said that before. We don't care about net worth, so the share price is irrelevant. And this is the final train in the game. It is basically perfect. Um, incredibly cheap to maintain. Incredibly fuel... If The fuel economy is outstanding. It never breaks down. Or well, near perfect breakdown. Passengers love it. It's diesel, so you don't need electric track. Um, the only downside is it's not very good on the hills. Well, it's okay on the hills. Um, and it does cost 1.2 million, which is more than every other train in the game. And it's got a slower top speed than the current electric train that we're using. But, it's stupidly good. It's just a shame it doesn't exist in real life. Like, apparently, this train came out last year, but it doesn't exist. The closest thing we have to this in real life would be, like, the uh, Japanese and kind of Chinese super high-speed trains. Like the microwave and the bullet train type stuff. Um, so I guess this train kind of exists in real life. But, uh... Yeah, not the other train. I'm afraid. Oh god, this one, this train. We need to upgrade this. Because this is an express train, even though it's not hauling any passengers at the moment. Ah, nearly had it. Right. Okay. We do have until... We do have until the end of, or the beginning of. It's either the beginning or end of 2018, I'm not sure which. I think all we need to do now is just sit back and wait for the silver to roll in. And the final guy's been fired. That means that that means that all the AI people have been fired. And it doesn't help how uh, that's worrying. The they are they are not happy with me. Um. Share price just keep going down, I guess. Um, well, just as long as we don't get fired, then everything will go to plan. I'm going to save the game. Houston is now five star city. Austin's four and a half. Dallas is five. Fort Worth is four and a half. Wow. Average speed of 187 miles an hour on the Austin Cannonball. The Austin Cannonball is this one. So Dallas to Austin at an average speed of 187 miles an hour. That is something. That is high speed for you. Almost had it. Oh, wow. Huh! Average speed for this year. I think that's for the... Yeah, I think that's for the year. 81 miles an hour. That is insane. I'm wondering... If we actually did play around with the net worth and try and get the net worth up to 25 million, will this go to 50 before the time runs out? Um, in which case, we could have got a gold if we were better with the net worth. Because it's 46 now. So, I mean... 
Yeah, if I actually put more effort into the net worth and was less aggressive at the start, although we have had a lot of recessions and depressions, this doesn't help. Hmm. Economy back on track. I don't really care, to be honest. Although it does mean that we make a bit more money. And they're back to neutral about our performance. Average speed for this year is 71. And uh, I want to upgrade this big diesel to a electric thing. And I think that's every train is now yeah, every train is now that super fast electric. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think we have until the end of 2018. So I'll just save it once more. Yes, yeah, so this will be um, this this will be a silver, a cup, an easy, a comfortable silver, but miles off the gold. Um, what? It's a really strange scenario, if I'm honest. Um. Because, I mean, like, connecting the cities is easy, so bronze is really easy. Um, the 40 miles an hour isn't difficult once you get... If, if you're careful early on, and once you get these super fast trains, the 40 miles an hour is not difficult. 50 miles an hour? How on earth are you meant to do 50 miles an hour? Um, I mean, I'm not, I'm not even doing 50 miles an hour now. Let's just, I could just buy back a lot of stock. How are they feeling? Oh, they're very pleased with me because we made a fortune. Yeah, we're not even doing 50 miles an hour now. Um, we've had these trains for quite a while. Uh, and the net worth 25 million. <sighs> That's probably doable, but to be honest, I'm, I'm happy with the silver on this scenario. Like, I'll. At a later date, I may come back to this scenario and try it again on Expert and try and get gold. Now is not that time. Um, I'm... I am happy with the silver. Um, I've built up a company that makes a lot of money. Um, We're we're an ext we're a very profitable company. We have a high speed rail network in Texas. Uh, to be honest, I think we've done a good job. We've set up a high speed rail network in the Lone Star States in the Triangular area. Uh, it's not the most expansive of networks, but we do have 1,500 miles of track, which is actually quite a lot. Um, and it's very fast. So, they wanted a high-speed railway network in Texas. We gave them a high-speed railway network in Texas. It's just a shame it wasn't slightly fast enough. Um, I don't think there's anything really more I could have done to increase the average express speed. Uh, I mean, we're using the fastest trains. We're using pretty direct routes. Yeah, I think that's a pretty accurate uh, summary of this scenario. Um, the silver is yours. Getting that train to zoom isn't as easy as it seems. Yeah, even when you're using a 300 mile an hour electric train, um, getting to 50 miles an hour as an average top speed is not easy. But hey-ho, uh, that is the end of this scenario. Um... That is the end of this scenario. That is the uh, end of the Tex-Mex scenario on silver, on expert. Um, again, I may, I may attempt this at a later date, sometime in the future, on expert again. I'll try and get gold and record it if I get gold. Um, but for now, that is the end of this video, so like, share, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!